She tore off her husband's faith. She swelled and turned gray. And she smelled like them. They remade her in brood mother. us. 
That's why they need us. That's why they take us. That's why they feed us. But the true abomination is not that it occurred, but that it was allowed. Branka, my love. The stone has punished me, dream friend. I am dying of something worse than death. Betrayal. If this Branca has survived, she'll be wary. Indeed. Yes. What was that? Let me be blunt with you. After all this time, my tolerance for social graces is fairly limited. That doesn't bother you, I hope. Well, shave my back and call me an elf! Bronca! By the stone! I barely recognized you! Ogryn, it figures you'd eventually find your way here. Hopefully you can find your way back more easily. And how shall I address you? Hired sword of the latest lordling to come looking for me? Just the only one who didn't mind Ogren's ale breath. Be respectful, woman. You're talking to a Grey Warden. Ah, so an important errand boy, then. I suppose something serious has happened. Is Endrin dead? That seems most likely. He was on the old and wheezy side. Hmm, Haramot, is it? Insufferable blowhard who's never had one memorable moment in his tradition-bound life. I don't care if the Assembly puts a drunken monkey on the throne. Because our protector, our great invention, the thing that once made our armies the envy of the world, is lost to the very dark spawn it should be fighting. The Anvil of the Void. The means by which the ancients forged their army of golems and held off the first archdemon ever to rise. It's here. So close I can taste it. And you assume, after all my efforts, you'll be able to waltz in and seize the anvil without a hitch? How typically arrogant. The anvil lies on the other side of a gauntlet of traps designed by Keradin himself. My people and I have given body and soul to unlocking its secrets. This is what's important. This has lasting meaning. If I succeed, the dwarven people benefit. Kings, 